Hi everybody, this is Ian Lamont, publisher of Google Drive and Google Docs in 30 Minutes, available from the In 30 Minutes Cheat Sheet Store. Today I'm going to be talking about quickly creating a resume on your iPhone using the Google Docs app. It's free, it's a very uh, a relatively easy way to create a resume if you need to do it in a short, in a short period of time just using the phone that you have uh, with you every day. So uh, if this video helps, please take a moment to follow my channel or like it and let's get started. Here is the uh, Google Docs iPhone app, iOS app. Uh, this works for iOS 14 or more recent versions of the operating system. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to tap the plus button in the lower right corner of the application. One of the options is choose template. Select that. And this is where all of the goodies are. Uh, they have these different resume templates. Actually, they have five different templates plus letters and everything else. We're just going to do the, let's do the coral resume. That's the one right in the middle. Tap that. And it opens it up. Okay, hello, I'm your name, all this information. You can see, obviously, that's fake. So what you want to do is you want to edit it. To edit the resume, tap the pencil icon in the lower right corner, and then tap where you want to start deleting stuff. So I'm going to tap, type my name, Ian Lamont. Um, actually, I'm just going to do it right at the top there. And then I would do my address here, my skills here. If I wanted to get rid of this stuff quickly, um, select all. Actually, that selects everything. So I'm going to use these little drag bars to select the text I want to get rid of, delete that, and then start typing. Whoops. Anyways, you might have to mess around with the formatting a little bit, but you get the idea. That, there we go. This is my summary. Okay. Now, obviously, on if you're using your fingers to type, that might be a little bit slow. Maybe you have a Bluetooth keyboard. You can also use the microphone icon to dictate into it, but just be careful that you're doing uh, you're, you're checking your work in case it tr transcribes it uh, not that well. And then um, make your resume. Once you're done, tap the check mark in the upper left corner. That will save it. And then you can go back to Google Docs. You can see its resume. If I want to, I could rename that to, um, let's call that... I tap, by the way, I just tap the three dots next to the name resume. I'm going to find rename, and then I'm going to call it something else. Uh, resume test rename. You get the idea. And of course, once it's in Google Docs, you can convert it to other formats, including PDF, Microsoft Word, etc. You can share it with other people. You can send it as a text message. You can send it in an email. All these great things. Uh, for more information on how to get the most out of Google Docs, Google Drive, Google Sheets, Google Slive, Slides, I wrote a whole book about it. If this video helped you, please take a moment to like it or follow me on YouTube. You can see more of my videos and blog posts on in30minutes.com or the Cheat Sheet Store. Thank you so much for watching.